In this video, we are going to be talking about Gabriel thalamide synthesis. So as the name suggests, it's used for the synthesis of some something and that thing is actually a primary amine. So this particular reaction is used for the synthesis of a primary amine. So first, as always, we'll start with the word reaction. So thalamide is undergoing a reaction in, I mean, is on treatment with alcoholic KOH forms potassium thalamide. This potassium thalamide is treated with an alkyl halide. So this is reacting with an alkyl halide to give us N alkyl thalamide. So it's reacting with an alkyl halide to give us N alkyl thalamide. Um, okay. So this particular substance is undergoing hydrolysis at um, with 20% HCl with 20% HCl under pressure and or it is refluxed with NaOH to give us a primary amine and we will have the thalamide part. No, it will form the sodium salt of thalic acid. So, a thalamide is undergoing reaction in the, is uh, basically converted to potassium thalamide in the presence of alcoholic KOH. This potassium thalamide is undergoing reaction with an alkyl halide to give us N-alkyl thalamide. That undergoes hydrolysis to give sodium salt of thalic acid and primary amine. So, let's write the reaction. Uh, we are taking thalamide. So this is thalamide, NH. Okay, this is thalamide. This is undergoing reaction with alcoholic KOH to give us potassium thalamide. That is, this hydrogen is going to be replaced by potassium. That's all. So the hydrogen attached to the nitrogen is getting replaced by a potassium atom. So you have this. So nitrogen will have a negative charge, potassium will have a positive charge. Okay, so or you can just write it one beside the other. Okay, now this is undergoing reaction with an alkyl halide and this is, let's take Rx. Okay, now what happens is, basically this K is getting kicked out and the R will come attached to the nitrogen. So basically we are doing all this to ensure that this hydrogen is getting kicked out and replaced by the R group. So this give us, gives us an N-alkyl thalamide. So I'll just write it down with because this guy here. NR, you have two double bonded oxygen atoms. Okay, and this is going to undergo hydrolysis to give us hydrolysis and in the presence of NaOH. So this can be done either using NaOH or done using 20% of HCl. So refluxing using NaOH is also a possibility. So this gives us potassium, sorry, sodium salt of thalic acid. So O minus Na plus O minus Na plus plus R and H2. Mm -hmm. 
So this reaction we are taking thalamide is a, this is thalamide it's undergoing reaction with alcoholic KOH. When it reacts with alcoholic KOH this H is getting kicked out and is replaced by potassium. So you get N plus N minus and K plus. This is reacting with an alkyl halide to give us sodium N alkyl thalamide which on hydrolysis with sodium hydroxide gives us sodium salt of thalic acid and a primary amine. So this reaction is actually used for the synthesis of primary amines and aromatic primary amines cannot be prepared by this method because aryl halides cannot undergo nucleophilic substituted such substitution with the anion thalamide. So it does not undergo nucleophilic substitution with thalamide because of that aryl uh, Aryl amines, primary amines or aromatic primary amines cannot be synthesized by Gabriel thalamide synthesis. Also, the thalic acid formed is actually reconverted back to thalamide by, by basically reverse, reversing it. And so the thalic acid uh, and basically we are just reusing the thalamide again and again. So that's about the Gabriel thalamide synthesis. One last time, thalamide is undergoing a reaction with alcoholic KOH to give us the potassium thalamide. This particular substance is reacting with alkyl halide to give us an N alkyl thalamide that undergoes hydrolysis to give us primary amine and a sodium salt of thalic acid. Remember, aromatic primary amines cannot be synthesized by this method. Secondary amines can also not be synthesized by this method. It's only primary amines that can be synthesized using this method. With that, we're done with great Gabriel thalamide synthesis. In the next video, we'll be talking about Hoffman bromamide degradation.